Hey friends, so I, I'm in the middle of ordering a new cable for my camera, so no face cam today, but here we are, back with part three of the bridge. Um, I hope you've been enjoying the series so far. The first one up, first episode went up like just a couple of days for me, so I like it so far. It's a pretty interesting kind of game, like most games are just 2D, um, you walk back and forth like this, but the uh, this definitely puts a new twist on what it means to be a puzzle. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, get into chapter three, I think, today. I think this is the last chapter, so this should be the last episode. Um, after this, I'll be posting my streams of Spyro, so look forward to that. All right, we've got part one of chapter three, the invasion. The inversion, sorry. Excuse me, I can't read, apparently. I'm not sick anymore, but apparently that doesn't mean I can read any better, so there's that. Let's see here, what do we have? We have, um, a chain. Do these boxes do anything? I mean, it doesn't look like any, like, they do anything right now. Um, where do we even need to go? Wait. Oh, okay, that's the door up there. I don't know what this chain, chain means. I think that's like, what's what? Right side up? What just happened? I don't know what that means. Why is he making a noise when I walk past there? Ah, uh ha. -huh. So we just went in a circle, sort of, loop. I think that's why we need to go. Ah, I don't even really need to tilt it. Because it's on a constant, like, curve, so. Um, I'm gonna head back to that spot where it kind of does, like, a little. Oh, hang on. It looked like the longer I was in there, the more it colored it? <gasps> oh, what? What did that mean? Hold on. Oh! Oh, that's... That's a new thing. Okay. So what happens when we... We walk now. Oh, we've... Literally inverted! That's clever. Wow, wow, wow. Well, now we know. Moving on to part two, the, ch the time piece. Alright, so it looks like we've got a, a menace. I think two menaces? Yeah, there's one up there and then there's the, the key down there. Where do I have to stand to invert this? That's my question. I assume I can't touch the key until I'm inverted. It's just how it is. Oh, wrong button. I meant to... I press spacebar instead of that button. So now if we walk to our left... What is the clock for? Yes, that is my key. Thank you. Now we're gonna get back into that bar so that we can invert back to where we can touch the door. Now if we flip all the way over, we can not get touched by that because we're not inverted. And we can go through the door. Perfect! Part three, the aftermath. Oh no. What does that mean? What happened? Oh no. Okay, this is where it usually gets to start- like starts to be a little bit more tricky, so I'm a little bit concerned for this man's little world. Oh, parts of it are destroyed. It's like an earthquake happened and now he's... Oh no. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to just keep walking. <laughs> keep walking, sir. Where you'll end up, I would love to know. 
And then there's no key involved, so it just looks like we have to invert this. And then he will come out over there. Wait, no, 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 this is the same as stage one. So even though, if we turn this all the way over, and then we keep walking. Oh, because we gotta, um, yes, I see, this worked, this worked out. Yeah, because now we gotta switch back. No, 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 wait. Because now he's on that side. Hold the phone, we gotta flip back over. Yeah, I've been inverted and cannot enter a gray door. Hmm. What if we jump down there, walk this way? Yeah, this should work, right? Because then when we invert again, we will be on the right side. And inverted correctly. Yeah! Ooh, I'm so smart sometimes. Nice. Part four, the antique. This is also a clock, right? I'm assuming. Because the other one was the first level just destroyed. So I wonder what the fifth level will be then. That'll be interesting to see. Okay, so it looks like we've got a key, a door with a lock on it, which the key is for. A switcheroo thing, and we're missing one of the clock corners. So we can't go up there until we get inverted. So let's do that. And let's get the key first and then we'll figure out how to get to the door, which shouldn't be too difficult, I don't think. Oh, just kidding. New plan. We're gonna move the key over first. And hopefully not fall out ourselves. Oh, okay. So I want to swap where me and the key are, so that when I get inverted back to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, snap, where am I going? Huh! Okay, um, new plan. If we are on the outside, looking in, will I ever be more than I've ever been? If I stand here on the outside of the clock, can I put the key where it needs to be, probably? In the spot with the door? Yeah. The key needs to be in the spot with the door. Then I come back in and go to that one there. Yes, this should work. So that when I come around, I will turn it again so then the key will be in the um, spot with the door. And then I will invert. Except I'll be up here too. No, that definitely won't work out. I need it to be exactly where I said it was. I need it to be. <sighs> okay. Is this the moment? This is exactly the moment. Somehow we've done it. Somehow we've gotten the key and we've succeeded. So now we can just go ahead and go back. I don't know what strategy that was supposed to be, but we did it. I just started turning the thing and we've made it. So we're gonna exit this level and head up to chapter five, the corridor. Or part five of chapter three, the corridor. Okay, we've got a menace. We've got a inverted menace. We've got a key. Where's the door? Right there, and it's inverted, so we gotta remember that. And then we've got a person to get to the key first. What happens if we invert here? We go there. Got it. We can't touch the key. And there comes the menace. Not good. Next idea, but there goes the key, which is not grayed out by the way, so I think we should be able to grab it with minimal problem. Oh no. <gasps> yep, never been inverted this way before on this level. This is new, and there goes the key. Where did we end up? There's the key. Thank god, okay. So now we need to invert back and somehow get to the door, so we gotta go this way? Although this is a self-contained situation, so we must invert back to go 
this way and hope that the ball isn't here. Yeah, okay. I think we're, we'll be fine on the ball front. That'll be fine. Yeah, because that's we're not we're not inverted. And then if we hit inverted up here, then we can go this way and right through the door. Wow, look at us. So smart. Okay. Level six, the garden. How many levels per thing? Did I miscount? I thought there were five per. I think I miscounted. Well, we're gonna take on the challenge. Oh boy, that is a lot of locks. Oh, when I said challenge, I did not mean this exactly. At least there's no menace things, because that's obnoxious. Okay, so we got one key, and then up here? Nope. But we can go this way. That is a thing we can do. Perfect. We're right back where we didn't want to be. Although, this could work out in our favor. I think it will. We invert that way. Then we can walk this way. I forgot we could turn all the way over this way as well. We got it. No, we already got that key. Oh, snap. I think we can grab the one that's hanging on the top there. We are smart about this. Yeah, here we are. Boom, key collected. Nice. Okay, so then we should also just be able to go this way then. And collect the one that's down there. Oh yeah, there it is, right there. Okay, so how do we get the last one? Let's see here, we have to go around that top loop. And then we're basically gonna do what we did last time after we invert. So we're gonna invert, and then we're gonna go up and around th this hump to our right. And now we have four keys. So the next challenge is to get us to the door while we're still inverted, which should be easy if we just take this little loop-de-loop, -loop, head back over, and here we are. Chapter three complete. Look at us go. Achievement unlocked, scholar. All right, who is this statue? Is this me when I'm old? His life fades, and with the color, with it, the color of this world. I often retreat here alone now, spending ages away from reality, unable to bear the future. In my solitude, my feelings breed the strangest of creations. Is there more to this? Oh, doesn't look like it is. It just says dot dot dot. Huh. Let's see what happens when we open this door. It'll take us back to our house. Okay. Surely, there is more my mind keeps from me. I will seek it and reve revel in its finding. Does that mean there's another level? Oh no. Um, okay. What is that noise? I thought I heard something. Maybe it's just me sliding. I don't know though, cause like now that we know we can invert things, maybe. <gasps> yeah, we have to invert ourselves. Oh, there's so much more to this game than I thought. Oh. Oh, I love this game. Is there more after this too? Oh my God, there is so much more. Oh my God, friends. Okay, well, this is it for this episode. Um, I have to end it here, unfortunately. So this is not the end of the bridge. Uh, I, wow. Okay. I'm blown away by this game again and again. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe for more videos like this, because I will definitely be finishing this game out on this channel. Um, and pushing back, posting any other, like, streams that I've planned. So, um, be sure to stay tuned for that. Subscribe so you get notified. Um, and hit the little bell so that you get notified. Um, and until next time, remember to stay cool, stay safe, and stay positive. I will see you in the next video.